Welcome Freedom here. Have you ever experienced in life that you came across a spot on piece of information without you looking for it and right when you needed to hear it the most? That's exactly what happened to me the other day from two different resources. I got the same realization about marketing and in a minute I will share it with you how that can make or break your business. My name is Istvan Show, and this is the 47 Marketing Show. I was watching a video by Russell Bronson a few days ago and he was talking about that successful entrepreneurs give what the market wants and do not try to force something down the throats of the market they think the market needs. Sometimes when you are excited about a new idea, it's easy to forget to ask people in your target audience what they actually want. And making that mistake in your marketing is almost all the time a guarantee for failure. What you think your target audience wants and what they actually want can be two very different things. When you have an idea for a new product or service or marketing campaign, always ask your target audience what they actually want and be open-minded to change your idea to give them what they want. Always do this before you implement your idea, otherwise you can create something that nobody wants and you waste your time and money. For me, it was a spot on reminder just a few days ago because I have this new idea for a software as a service solution and education bundle to help entrepreneurs to create and publish daily engaging social media content consistently while saving those entrepreneurs hours of time and work every week. The idea is not to create another social media management tool like Buffer or Hootsuite that are more focused on the publishing part. This software idea is focused on the content creation part and to save entrepreneurs hours of time and work every week on that. But right now, this is only an idea, only an assumption on what people want it's super exciting and I can't wait for us to actually implement it and make it a reality. At the same time, I know there are important steps to take before starting to implement any new project ideas. And I got another great reminder of that. The same day I watched that video, I happened to have a call with somebody from my target audience. On the call, I started to ask him a bunch of questions about what they do in the area of content creation and publishing and what they want. And it was so interesting to experience the same realization again, what you think your target audience wants and what they actually want can be two very different things. Even just a short 10 minutes conversation with somebody in your target audience can give you invaluable insights that can change your idea into an absolutely successful one. And when you talk to 50 or 100 or even more people, you will see crucial patterns what they actually want. When you give them that, you will have a much bigger chance to succeed with your marketing, sales and business. And with that said, I'm going to do a shameless plug here. I'm looking for entrepreneurs who know they need to publish onto social media daily, but for some reason they are not doing it. If you're one of those entrepreneurs, I would love to have a quick chat with you and hear your opinion on creating and publishing your own content to social media. I'm only doing this for research, so you are not going to be sold anything on the call, I promise. We will have a simple, friendly 30-minute conversation about creating and publishing social media content. I will ask some questions and you can ask any of your questions on the topic as well. Um, in case you are new here, me and my team have been publishing 20 plus content pieces every week 
in the past 18 months. So any questions you have on content creation and publishing, I'm happy to answer them based on what we learned so far throughout that real life experience. If you are up for a quick chat, a quick friendly chat uh, on creating and publishing content, then click on the link in the description, message me and we will arrange a call. Okay, this is it for now. Thank you for being here today. Speak soon and see you in the next episode.